Hey guys, I'm over here at a permaculture Airbnb and I wanted to show you an incredibly simple and easy composting toilet for anyone who has been interested in this because I used to think there was just more to it and you had to buy this expensive thing, but this is so simple. I took this out. All you literally need is technically a bucket and some sort of carbon product wood shavings, sawdust. In this case, this is actually like a leftover aspen shaving for, from a local uh, producer of a product that uses aspen wood. Um, and so what these folks have done is create a really beautiful setup uh, because they're really savvy with woodworking and such. But you know, you get this stuff, you just dump it into their little area here or whatever you would like to have for a holder. So in this case, it's this, it's a little cup to use it. All right, and this bucket looks really dirty from the shavings, that's okay. But they built this thing to have a toilet seat, right? And the whole thing just flips right out like this. You, you stick your clean bucket in. Hello, just like that. <laughs> and bring it down and here you go. And here's your seat, here's the bucket. And as soon as, this gets to about like three quarters high. You change it out again with a clean bucket and you can use this for your compost or whatever you're gonna do with it, uh, it, you know, if you're into that type of composting. There's a lot of information about that kind of composting out there. You gotta be into it. There are some thing, precautions that you should take uh, for human manure, uh, as it's called, um, but it's really this simple. So every time you make your deposit, you go ahead and scoop enough of this to, to cover it and you pour it in and that's it. Um, believe it or not, it doesn't smell at all. I could personally attest to that. Uh, just like any other regular bathroom and toilet situation, it is good to have a window or a door uh, for, for some ventilation, but seriously, it smells no more uh, than a regular situation. That is technically your flush, is just putting that carbon uh, product on top. Uh, it could even be dried leaves that are ground up, by the way. Anything that could absorb uh, and cover paper product, whatever it is. So uh, I just think that this is really neat, um, really nifty, so easy. Just wanted to share it with you guys real quick. I hope you enjoyed this. If you have any comments, feel free to leave them. And until next time.